Jos Plateau State is known for its serenity, cold climate and favorable weather condition similar to that of the Europe. This has made it a tourist center for many foreigners to dwell in. The hospitable and commercial nature of this place has also encouraged foreign settlers. But to the dismay of the community of Abattoir local government just south of Plateau State, Nigeria, the Lebanese residing amongst them have for years been sexually molesting minors and girls aged 11 to 14 years. This manic have been going on and all effort to stop such acts proved abortive. Our girls have been, have been molested by a Lebanese man. Even though you are saying the girls are not hearing what, are you the one to teach them? You go there and be sleeping with the man. After you sleep with the girls, I mean, these girls have been, one of them has confessed. So these girls now are here, the Lebanese man is not here. Now, we want to see the man. We want the government to stand up because their parents don't have it. That doesn't mean that they should suffer. Two of them are pregnant. Only the girls and go back to the police station, not even the man. So the whole youth want to see the man. Where is the man? The whole youth want to see... As security agencies such as the police end up releasing the culprits who commit such acts and in turn blame victims and their parents for not portraying acts of discipline. This made many victims of these heinous crimes lie low and keep mute when molested. Many prefer to keep this as a secret to guard their dignity. As such, many died, some stigmatized and infected with HIV. The police cannot manipulate. The suspect has been arrested and is currently at the State Criminal Investigation Department for investigation. On the 14th May 2021, the abattoir residents were filled with fury, anger, as they have had enough following the recent molestation of over 14 girls, out of which two got pregnant and 12 others left stigmatized. <laughs> Go ahead and eat him. If you sleep with you, go 